want to start here with this clip of, uh, of Bernie Sanders. This is how you know the media is against Bernie Sanders. Check this clip out. Your agenda has promised free health care for everybody, free college tuition, and to pay off people's college loans. The price tag for that is estimated to be $60 trillion over 10 years, correct? Well, look, we have political opponents. You don't know. Come up. You don't know how much your plan costs. You don't know. Nobody knows. This is impossible. You're going to propose a plan to the American people, and you're not going to tell them how much it costs. Oh, the fake outrage! You're going to propose? Oh, Nora, give me a break. Now, first of all, my one criticism of Bernie here: you know, a politician is not going to answer the question when they start out their answer with, "Well, look, <laughs> like no, no truth is coming from that point forward." But the main point here is. The media's got the fix in against Bernie. If Nora O'Donnell liked Bernie Sanders, first of all, she'd never bring it up, but she would help him make, make the case, or she, she'd make some comment that, uh, Senator Sanders, you, your plans are, are bold and ambitious. I think that would be the question. <laughs> she, or, or she'd say, you know, Senator Sanders, um, Heartless Republicans are, are pouncing on your plan. Um, what, Bernie, what, do you, what can the people do to help Republicans understand that you can't put a price tag on our children? Right? It would be some nonsense like that. But they don't like Bernie. I mean, ne never forget this debate moment. This was on the, the last CNN debate. Senator Sanders, I do want to be clear here. You're saying that you never told Senator Warren that a woman could not win the election. That is correct. Senator Warren, what did you think when Senator Sand Sanders told you a woman could not win the election? I disagreed. <laughs> Bernie is my friend, and we're I'm not there. here we're to try there. to fight what, with Bernie. What a total hit job. And I love the clip of Bernie's like, geez, guys. I saw a lot of people giving props to CBS, the first clip we played. A lot of people giving props to CBS for asking hard questions to a Democrat. No, 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 no. That's not what they were doing. They were trying to, to take out one candidate. They're not going to start talking like that to the Democrats. They're not going to ask hard questions to the Democrats. They're just going to ask questions like that to, to Bernie to knock him out because they love Elizabeth Warren. But Elizabeth Warren, her plans are just as insane. So Bernie's plan may cost, what, what she's like, 60 trillion or something. Elizabeth Warren's are like 58 trillion. So like, what's, <laughs> and she can't pay for it or account for it either, right? So what's the difference? Uh, I want to talk more about Elizabeth. Uh, you've heard this audio by now. It needs to be getting way more attention, so I'm going to play it again. Here's a, a guy in Iowa confronting Elizabeth Warren. My daughter can have school and save all my money. She doesn't have any school. Am I going to get my money back? So you're going to pay for people getting their money back? Yeah. Okay. So you're going to pay for people who didn't save any money, and those of us who did the right thing get screwed. Of course we did. My buddy had fun, bought a car, went on vacation. I saved my money. He made more than I did. I work a double shift, work extra, my daughter's work, she is 10. So you're laughing. Yeah, that's exactly what you're doing. We did the right thing and we get screwed. I appreciate it. Awesome. Every year has got a Joe the Plumber moment. We need more from that guy. Where is that guy? We need more from him. And we need way more of that guy.